Hey, yo, what's up, everybody? This is your guy, Dan Tana, the bad boy of tech. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to add widgets to your home screen in iOS 14. I'm going crazy, bro. I'm telling you. This video was requested by a few of my subscribers and people. I love my subs. You guys are family to me. For sheezy. So enough of me yapping. It's time to make it happen. Let's go. <laughs> Well, okay, here I am at the home screen of my iPhone. And people, as you can see, at the top of my screen, I got the smart widget to where I can scroll through things. But let's say I wanna add an extra widget. Well, I'm about to show you this. This is very quick, so pay attention. Okay! All you have to do is long press on the widget, and when the menu comes up, go to edit home screen, press that, then at the top left, press the plus icon, scroll up and down the list to find out which widget you want. In this case, we're gonna do batteries. Press on that. Then where it says add widget, press on that. Then when it's on the home screen, you can move the widget around to where you see fit. Then hit done. Woo! It's just that simple. Okay, I showed you how to add a widget and everything, but let's say you want to have less apps on your home screen without deleting them. Let me show you something. Let's say for demonstration's sake, I want to get rid of the Booksy Biz app. All you have to do is long press on the app, go to edit home screen, click on that, then hit the minus button on the app. Now instead of pressing delete, which would delete the app off your phone altogether, you hit add to library. Bam. Then after that, hit done. Alrighty then. And what that step right there did is sent the app right to the app library to where you can still fully use it and everything, but added some more sauce to the feng shui of your home screen. He ain't lying. Now also on iOS 14 people, the camera layout has changed, especially in video mode. Now remember in video mode, in order to change the resolution, we used to have to leave the app, go into settings, then change it. Not anymore. You see up top, that's the resolution. All you have to do is tap. What? Right now, it's set to 4K and 24 frames per second. All you have to do is to tap the 4K, the resolution, to change it. Now it's in regular HD. And for the frames per second, it's the same thing. Instead of 30, I want 60. So I tap it. Bam, it's at 60. It's just that simple. Apple, that's absolutely lit. Yeah! Well, all right, everybody, that just about does it for this one. So if you like what you saw and like what you heard, please give your guy and iOS 14 a thumbs up because that's official. Yes, sir, yes, sir. But if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, what? To feel the swag and madness of Dan Tanner and Team Lit, then do that too, because that's official too. All right, everybody, get money, get respect, and enjoy your tech. Be easy.